Hey art friends, welcome to today's how to. Today we'll be learning how to draw kick and chicken from Poppy Playtime 3. So first let's get started by drawing in the mouth. So on the left hand side we're going to curve this line up, down, and then in towards the middle. On the right hand side now we're going to connect this together. So starting on the right hand side we're going to curve this line up, down, and then blending that in on that center line. We're going to draw a nice big arch line now. So on the left hand side, we're going to arch this line down towards the bottom, curving this in towards the middle. And then on the right hand side, we'll replicate that, curving this all the way around and then connecting that on that bottom line. For the tongue in the center, we're going to arch this line across and then over towards the left. And then moving over towards the right, we're going to arch that over and down. Moving further down on our line towards the right for the nose, we're going to arch this line up, bringing that back down and in. For the eye now, on the right hand side coming up, we're going to draw a curved diagonal line that comes down. And then we're going to arch this line over and across. On the inside line, we're going to arch this line down towards our nose. And then on the right hand side, we're going to curve this line around and then in. Behind the nose we're going to draw a small oval shape. Moving up on a diagonal now for the eyebrow we're going to draw an arch line on the top bringing that over. On the left hand side now starting on the side of the nose we're going to arch this line up towards the top and then bringing that down on the side. And then in that corner we're going to curve that line around and then in. In the center now we're going to draw in a small oval shape. For the cheeks now, on the right hand side we're going to curve this line around and then in. And we'll do the same thing as we come up on the left hand side. Moving further down now we're going to curve this line around and then in. And we'll do the same thing on the right. Moving over to the corner on the left hand side now we're going to curve this line down and then in towards the middle. And then flipping over to the right we'll replicate that, blending that in. For the top of the head now starting underneath the eyebrow we're going to curve this line up and then bringing that down. And then to the right of this we're going to bring this up and then back down. On the left hand side now we're going to curve this line around and then in. In the corner we're going to curve this down towards the top of the head. Starting back on this line on the top now let's curve this all the way around bringing that in towards the top. Moving behind this now we're going to curve this across and then back in towards the right hand side of our head. And now to the right of this even smaller we're going to curve this line around and then in. For the shoulder now on the top we're going to curve this line around and then in towards the middle. On the bottom now we're going to curve this line up and then across. And now starting at that point we're going to curve that over and out. In the corner here we're going to curve this up, connecting that as we curve that out. For the bottom arm now we're going to start in the corner here curving this line around and then back in. In the center let's draw in a star now. So on the left hand side we're going to curve this line out and then in. And we'll do the same thing over on the right. Starting in the middle now we're going to curve this up towards our chin and then back down on the right hand side. And then moving in behind this we're just going to draw a small arch line bringing that down. On the left hand side now we're going to curve this line around and out. And then moving underneath on the right hand side we're going to curve this all the way across and over towards the left leaving a small gap. For our leg on the right hand side we're going to curve this line around and then down towards the bottom page. And then on the right hand side we're going to curve this around and out. For our foot now we're going to curve this down on a diagonal bringing that back up. 
in the center, we're going to arch this across, back up in the middle, and then one more time, we're going to bring that out and then up, connecting that on the side. Let's draw a curved line now from left to right, closing that off. On the inside, we're going to draw an arch line that curves down, and we'll do the same thing on the right hand side. On this inside line now, we're going to curve this across and then back in for the foot. And then one last time, we're going to bring this out and then up. Let's draw another curved line from left to right. For the tail, we're going to start in the corner, curving this up and out. Starting back on that line, we're going to curve this line around and then in. Moving in towards the middle now, we're going to curve this back around and then up. And now one last time, we're going to curve this around and then in towards our left leg. And that is it. That's how you draw Kick and Chicken from Poppy Playtime 3. You can pause the video and color it the way that I have done, or you can change your colors up if you'd like. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel, and also drop a comment below suggesting any more characters that you'd love to learn to draw next. Thanks so much for joining me on today's tutorial, and I will see you all on the next one.